the Treasure Seekers Pirate Ship, which is new from VTech for ages one and a half to four years. But believe you and me, the adults are going to be playing with this little ship too, because it is amazing. It has over 180 phrases, songs, sounds, and melodies. It includes recognition points to put Captain Monty and Sailor Stanley on to hear songs and phrases, and you can launch your cannonball from the cannon with real sound. Awesome. In addition, the ship does open up for extra play. It has light up buttons that teach beginning letters, objects, and numbers. It does require two AA, those are LR6 batteries. The demo batteries are in there. Just go ahead and get your AA's ready. You're going to need them. And it has two volume levels with automatic shutoff. R. Now, let's remove it from the packaging and see who walks the plank. I have my pirate ship unboxed and yo ho ho, I gotta tell you, VTech has hit a home run with this one in my opinion. We have our octopus. It does slide across and the tentacles spin. It's a lot of fun. The cannon does shoot the cannonball. Lots of sounds with that cannon. Loving it. And what's a pirate ship without treasure? There's so much going on with this ship, there's no way I can show you everything that it has. We do have the pull cord up front. It does come out, it, it, and you can see it does store. There are three different modes. In the first mode, it teaches things such as colors, objects, letters, and counting. Each button has five different things it says, and you can put your characters on the recognition point. Each character does have five different phrases that it says. Mode 2 is role playing. Oh my goodness. The ship will give you lots of things to perform. There are so many things going on, I didn't even finish them. I could play this all night long. Mode 3 is songs and melodies. Press the buttons to hear them. Also, your characters can go back on the recognition point and they will sing. As I stated, when you open it up, there is a treasure island mode. I will quickly go through the modes with the ship closed, and then I'll open it up and demonstrate the treasure island mode. Let's go ahead and turn it on. Turn it on loud. Welcome aboard. Hi there. Let's explore. Press one of the buttons to play. This is the number one. This button is red. Red begins with the letter R. Anchor begins with the letter A. Anchor. There is one. Anchor. Sales begins with the letter S. This is the number two. This button is green. Lots of things going on, but let's go ahead and try a recognition point. Straight ahead. It's time for an adventure. <laughs> Treasure begins with the letter D. And the cannon. Jolly good. <laughs> let's go ahead and hear Sailor Stanley. Anchors up. Try mode two. Let's pretend and play. A storm is a brewing. To protect the ship, lower the sails. Sailor in position. Sailor, please lower the sails. We'll push number Aye. here with the sails. Now press the sails button to lower the sails. Great, the sails are lowered. Let's 
party time. Put a character on the purple bowl to play. We'll put the captain up there. Yo ho ho! It's a jolly party! Captain Bunty here. <laughs> Yay, Captain Monty. One of the buttons to play. I'm going to move Captain Monty. Put him up here. You can see the cells do turn. There's a seesaw in here. They can both go on. Maybe your ship is on rough seas. Now I'll open it up and show you the Treasure Island mode. Press a button to hear fun music. Right. I have it on the Treasure Island mode. Now, when you open up your ship, it does come with a sticker sheet, and you will need to apply all the stickers on the inside. It's not too hard. They have a diagram, plus, you know, the box was extremely helpful in that regard. Oh, no, they have rough seas. Oh, hold on. But, alas, we have pirates. Oh, no. They're making Sailor Stanley walk the plank. Oh, we'll put him here. Oh, there went Sailor Stanley. 